and welcome! My name is Lissa, and this is Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, so last we left off, we were in San Denis. And now, we're gonna continue being in San Denis. Um, I think... Uh... We're gonna try to look at doing some... I think we're gonna try to do some, uh side quests first just just to see is there anything yeah we gotta get an albert mason mission looks like that's about it so let's go do real quick let's <coughs> start the san Denis adventures off by um not being in san Denis. um oh this is the photographer let's go let's go help this man take some pictures Let's do that. I like that idea. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Um. Okay, cool. I simply just did not want to pass by the yellow. Because I don't want to accidentally start a mission. But. Well. We can just. Okay, cool. Great. Great! Let's go help man take pictures, and then we'll come back to San Me and do some quests. We can get our boy Jack back. Um, yeah. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. What the heck? What the heck? Hey, 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 hey. hey. Let me, let me. Hello, yes, the sheriff is here, and oh boy, do I got some new buttons I can press. So yes, uh, we've, we're really moving up in the world here. Um, I have uh, appointed some mods now. We have mods. And uh, Ouroboros Unchained, Dustin, is one of our lovely mods here. And um, he's just, you know, as a sheriff does, is here to keep the peace. So, uh, he might abuse his power. I'm just letting y'all know that. <laughs> and by that, she means Nightbot is a mod now, so do not taunt the robot. <laughs> Ban me, I dare you. Well, Carlos. Hello, Mr. Mason. I'm here to help you take some pictures. Well, ha, Carlos. Hello, Mr. Mason, what's up? I'm here to help. Creep up Get Hexner. <laughs> Mr. Morgan. How are you? Well, sir. What are you working on? Do you know anything about alligator? Only the basics. Avoid them wherever possible. <laughs> well, yeah. did you know that in the last 50 years, we've killed 90%? You say that like it makes you sad. They're beautiful creatures. <laughs> Let's see how you speak when one of them's got you in a death row. Yes, I will make some creature a very happy lunch one of these days. Let's try mm -hmm. and avoid that from happening today. Hmm? <laughs> when you stay there, you'll get a great shot. Then you'll get eaten. <sighs> what a way to go. Why don't we take this boat out? I like that uh, fourth wall break right there. That was funny. Get in the boat. He'll be fine. Well, if you really think that's necessary, you carry on shooting for uh, that. Red Dead back. alligators can accurately gallop, and that terrifies me. Really? Yeah, no, yes. they're they're terrifying. Also, we have in the earrings of Javier and Sean today, so the nasty ones. you know. All right then. Um, oh, I saw a movement to the north of us. Oh, into the west. Oh, into the northwest there. Oh, that's probably where we should look. Let's go well, look then. When we find one. Line me up nice. so I can get the shot. Nice. Nice. Don't get too close. You'll scare them away. Close, but not too close. Got it. Got it. Let's just take this man out on a nice boat ride through a swamp with alligators. Last year, they brought 10,000 skins out of the swamps of Lemoyne alone. The gators got some catching up to do there. Cases, trunks, shoes. The alligators won't venture far from the weeds on the shoreline. That little beach. Uh, if 
we're in luck. An alligator won't be far away. Saving alligators, but you don't mind that pork chop getting butchered. Pork chop. I also have the ability to set extension. chat to pog only mode. You know, in the season, there are more alligator hunters down here than than alligators. Look at them. Alligator. It's got it. Quick, quick. I must get this shot. We caught him. In the middle of his dinner. This nice. is history making, truly. Nature. In all its glory. And cruelty. Could have been you if you stayed on that bank where I found you. Don't. Okay. So, um, now it's southwest or due west. Uh... Let's just go to the next closest feet, one. 19 feet. 21 feet with a five foot head. What? They found some big bulls in these parts. Surely they did. There's okay. 20 foot gators here, and us two idiots are sitting Starting. in a 12 foot skiff? No. Oh. This is in the 70s, 80s. All the really big gators have been hunted out and killed. Oh. Not the shame, I say. It's terrible. Well, that's upsetting. It ain't shame to this rolling fool. Who values his arms being attached to his body? It's them or us, especially with the big ones. Right, right. There, in the cane rake. That's okay. A spot for one. There. Well, I see one right there. You see its head? Poking up there. Line is up to it. Oh, straight ahead. Over to the left. Right over there. I got you, bro. Beast in repose. All is calm cool. as the predator lurks. TV is gonna set up an auto uh, uh, automat a bit more involved than that. Cool. Like live your dreams, Dustin. I just wanted to make sure that there was somebody else involved who was like a little bit maybe a bit more knowledgeable than me about it all. Oh, uh, this was the wrong direction to go. But we're we're making it work. We're making it work! Too long. Locals are gonna start getting curious. Just, just there, please. So, so I'm facing the landmass. Right. Now look, there's an alligator back in those palms. Could you, could you run in there and coax him out? Coax him? Please. He's quite something. If I could take that fellow's likeness, it might. Okay. It might just save him from the taxidermist. <sighs> Fine. Now rotate us so I have a shot of the island. Okay. Maybe I want this monster stuffed in on display. Oh, that's the spirit. Out you go then. Get him and uh, get him to notice you, and then turn tail and run. I don't like this. Not hey. one bit. Hey. Oh, he's awake. I hope you're slow. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, Dustin! Thanks for all of the um, all of the thanks for the four the four gift subs. Thank you. What a fast boy! Yeah, that was terrifying. Thank you for all of the thank you for the four gift subs, Dustin. That's really nice of you. Thank you. The nation will see these beautiful beasts for what they are. Killing machines. Yeah, you got a sub. What's up, Pro Mang? How's it going? Yes. Maybe that's not a bad thing. How's it going? America, after all. We hold a love for killers that borders on macabre. Loving killers yeah, is part of our makeup. True. Maybe, maybe. Okay. We, we wait until after they're dead. Well, Look at those four gift subs popping. And what's up, you guys? How's it going? Okay. Let's get back to back to on land. One of us. One of us. Looky here, I feel old now. Look at you, Carlos. Three months. Three months. How's it going? Thank you for the three months, Carlos. Thank you for the, for the subs, guys. Thank you. That's really, really nice of y'all. Okay, let's get back. Let's get back. I 
I can't believe that we've been affiliate long enough to have three month subs. That's a lot to me. That feels that feels very nice. Thank you guys. Ah yes. Doctor here. Just of course. To the bank. I'm, it's what I'm doing. That should do us. Yes. Okay. These pictures you're taking. Yes. They gonna be any good? Oh, I certainly hope so. Though I doubt it. The subject is magnificent. The backdrop, jaw dropping. But the agent of beauty is a talentless fool. Excuse me. Although maybe I'll strike a few lucky shots. You sure do maybe. make me laugh that way you talk about yourself, Mr. Mason. Well, I'm good for laughing at, <laughs> if nothing else. I didn't mean it like that. Else. I know. Still, I feel such a fool around you, sir. Don't worry about it. Oh. Bye, Mr. Mason. I foresaw many an ignominious future for myself, but never damsel in distress. Well, uh, good luck, Mr. Mason. Thank you, and to you too, sir. Try and stay out of trouble. I shall certainly Can try. Do. Also, Alyssa, you weren't redeeming those simps. You're probably about to get 20 messages full of it. <laughs> hmm. 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 <laughs> Okay. We did a nice mission for Mr. Mason. That's grand. I love it. Now let's get a... Let's get on yep. back into town and see if we can find Jack. Yep. Or not. Looks like it just clears the queue with no notifications. I have no clue, my guy. I just know Red Dead. Monsieur. Monsieur. Yeah. 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 Hello, sir. Saint Denis. Let's get in here and find Jack. So it's meant to let you make sure you're following up on anything like giveaways or questions to get renamed. So the only ones that really need to stay in the queue theoretically are for choosing your character in Star Wars. Yeah. That's you got understandable. A with me? No? Hello. Sir. Excuse me, I'm trying to find What's a the sword badge you have now? It means I have a no sword. Name? It's he's a mod Dante? now. No, don't think so. Sorry. Okay, thank you. We have we have given given him a sword, probably against our better judgment. Hey there. Have you ever heard of a man called Angelo Bronte? Hmm, no. But fancy name like that? Maybe try the Bastille Saloon. Bastille Opposite Saloon. The with the Quincy Harris statue. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Anyway, hope you find who you're looking for. Thank you. Alright. That's very boy. nice of you. He's power tripping. He is. Yeah, it's fine. Listen, I wouldn't have given him mod if I didn't want to cause a little bit of chaos. No, get get out of the way, horse. Let's go. The trolley. Let me just park my horse right here. I feel like that's a decent spot for him. Oh. There's a hitching post right there. It's fine. What up? Good music, my guy. Sounds great. Sounds good. Um, the saloon. That's where I'm supposed to be going, right? The saloon. 
Look out! The saloon. The saloon. Stick him oh. up, cowboy. So I knocked his teeth out. Well, I don't. <laughs> Dutch. Yeah, real funny, Dutch. Oh, I thought so. So here we are in a strange land of papists and rapists. America's very <laughs> hey, Dutch. This city's all of the same to me. So, how you get on? I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. From what I've heard, this establishment is our best lead, but I haven't had any joy in there so far. So, I should just give it a shot? I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me? Of course, Dutch. I'll meet you back here in nine. I'm slick as a brick. Oh, gosh. I just, I'm just walking in like, chill out, guys. I want, I Why want to eat. Why say that? Well, you know how it is. I told him, I say, that's the state of Lamorn for you. America's dirty little French secret. <laughs> that's why we love it. Born and raised. Mm. Well, I'm a transplant, but I'm never leaving. I'm a transplant. Not the best part is the power tripping is automated. Away. I can set night watch to time out anyone. Yeah, he says, heck, yeah, you take a nap. It ain't happened yet. <laughs> You can. Well, let me tell you something. The rest of the states, they lucky to have us. If it wasn't for us, they'd probably have run back to Britain with the tails between their legs at the first sign of trouble. You got that mm -hmm. right. Now, how can I help? You look like a whiskey man. Give me sure. a whiskey. Dollar, please. For I got a whiskey? dollar. Oh, that's the real stuff. From Scotland. Okay. okay. Here, have one for yourself. Well, thank you. So we, we have three thousand dollars. We can spare it. We can spare it. <laughs> you ever hear of a fellow by the name of Bronte? Who's asking? Me. Do I have to I'm unsub asking. to use my Twitch Prime no, sub? Leave it, Fred. What do you mean, leave it? Look, I don't know uh -huh. what business you in, but leave it, Fred. You and your pal. Are you literally thousands of dollars by the good whiskey while you're in town? <laughs> Gonna lose my streak. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. Bronte? Angelo Bronte. Mr. Big, Mr. Italian, spaghetti eating, long streak of piss big. What? Yeah, it makes my skin crawl. What? Why are you cocksucker? You know what I mean, friend? Sure. Where can huh? I find him? Oh, well, I reckon you talk to them kids in the alley, they'll know how I get. Okay. Oh, and friend? You, Where's you your arm candy? Now? Immigrants, uh, they're not to be trusted. Oh, well, I don't like you anymore. Uh, Dayton is not here today. He, um, he is, uh, we are metaphorically taking off the training wheels on Red Dead. I'm taking over. He's, uh, in chat. He, uh, last I knew he was getting pizza, but, um, he, uh, should be... Should be in chat as soon as he Come acquires now, his pizza and gets home. You. you always have to be right, don't you? I'm just giving you the correct use of the word. If you're feeling sick, you're not nauseous, you're nauseated. Right, you're nauseous and I'm nauseated. You're impossible. <laughs> Me. Yes? Is there something you need? I was told to talk to people, but I don't know where those people are. These kids? Oh! Hey, hey you got Dustin, cigarettes! Dustin, thank Maybe. you for the gift huh? sub! I'm looking for a fellow named Angelo Bronte. I tell you. I know him. Everyone knows him. Where is he? We'll take you to him. What it'll cost. I reckon I can pay. Five dollars. Where's he live? New York? I'm an entrepreneur. New York? If you don't pay, then I don't want to walk. Look at all these subs that are happening right now. Thank you so much. This away. Let's go, Miss. One more, just to make sure. Since apparently they pull two dollars, so two fifty, like I thought. Supposed. Stay close. You get lost around here. Okay. Come on then. I'm, I'm following you, kid. Pretty much. Don't worry. No one knows as good as me and Cleet. Is that right? Okay. Hope you won't need his services, but you got the doctor on the corner there. Nice enough, fella. 
That's Baron and Schreiber on the right there. Famous bookstore. Not that I'm much of a reader myself. Now over okay. here's a real piece of art. That's the Church of the Holy Blessed Virgin, mister. Model on the famous church in Toulouse, which is in France. You okay. been in Toulouse, mister? No. We're Catholics here, mister. Ain't Baptist or nothing. My mama okay. said they used to burn Protestants and all, but, uh... Bet they don't have nothing so fine where you come from, mister. Look at them fine steeples. Hey, hey, <laughs> you little pair of shits. Get going. He's coming after us. You better stop right now. Can I not get it? Aw, oh, dang. I want to lasso him. I want to lasso him. I got my lasso out. Bye, mister. <laughs> no. No. I'm trying to chase him, but I'm not fast enough. Stop. Shit. Oh, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Currently playing D&D &D with a little watch we play later, homie. We haven't played in three months and we're investigating a cult church. Nice. The trolley driver's gonna get a speed and ticket. That's the fastest we're gone. You that kid? How does shit went that way? Thanks for the help, friend. You know, I kind of miss old Bob Tate. No, not that way. Where? Where? I got my lasso out. I just want to lasso the kid. <laughs> Bet you didn't think I could climb, you little jerk, huh? I'm sorry, ma'am. I didn't mean to step on your face. I'm just trying to get this little kid who's being a jerk. I am slow, but it's not it, it's not my intention to be slow. This is your last warning, boy. Uh. There he is. This is fun, mister. I like you. Oh my gosh. What's the problem, friend? I have guns too. What are you talking about, friend? I ain't your friend. But that kid is. And he robbed from me. Now give me back my stuff and take me to Angelo Bronte. Senor Bronte. The kid was gonna show me before he robbed me. Now. Come on. You new in town, mister? Come on. Mr. Bronte's got a lot of friends, mister, but I ain't never seen you. We ain't friends. <laughs> you don't like no one, mister. Mr. Bronte, he's got fine hair. He got a beautiful house, and I am proud to work for him. He got 50 men, mister. Why are you gonna care a thing about you? I just want to speak with him. <laughs> I'm sure you do, mister. You and them friends of yours been asking about him all over town. He been mighty disrespected. Bunch of muddy Yankees in town asking questions. Mm -hmm. Well, you and your friends should pay him a visit, mister. He's got a big house on Flavian Street opposite the park. Hey, Yoko. Now, 
Get out of here. I don't like those kids. I want to punch them all. Where do I, I gotta meet a back up with Dutch to let him know, right? Gosh. Someday. Did they just take a hundred out and leave the rest? I don't think they took anything. Sir, I want you to have this. Thanks, friend. What'd he give me? It's nice to give something instead of just begging. I got you. Okay. I ain't asking for money like a goddamn worm. Groveling here in the dirt. You're a cool guy. I'm, I respect. I respect you. I respect you. Okay. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I don't like any of those kids. Not a fan of them. Okay. Get back here to the saloon. Talk to Dutch. Let him know. This is what these horrible kids told me. These horrendous little Make children. How are you getting off? Cool. Where is he? Dutch! Dutch! Parker, over here. I hear you. I can't see you. There you are, Dutch. What's up? Okay, most annoying people to pull a gun on you recently, Mumbai. right? Bunch of children. <laughs> I won't inquire anymore. But I found Mr. Bronte. Seems to be some Italian Mr. Big in town. Everybody knows him, but nobody wants to talk about him. Apparently he lives <laughs> in a big house on Flavian Street opposite the park. Ah, good work. So what now? We go pay him a visit. I'll get John. You meet us there. Whatever it takes, we need to get that boy back. That's true, we do. Let's get our boy back. Let's get our boy home. Loading screens. Man, I love loading. Okay. I cannot decide which I like less. The swamps or the city. Both are full of... Parasites, reptiles, and slime. Mm -hmm. We're a long way east of land we know, and far from real open country. Yeah. Also, was pressing buttons trying to rearrange my badges. Apparently, I've sent over a thousand messages in your chat. Nice. Okay, we've got more. We've got more missions to do. So let's go do some of these missions. Uh, my horse is over on that side. Oh, let's go. Let's go to the horse. I'm sorry, I didn't get it. I don't mean to run in anybody, but oh, hello, hello. You ain't scared nobody. Drink, mon ami. Okay. Sure, what you want? Brandy. Two brandies, bud. It's two dollars a glass. Oh, better be good then. Mm. It's the best. Thank you. Santé. French guy. <laughs> ah, it's quite a country you're building here, eh? Well, me personally? Hmm? I don't know. What do you do? Mostly, I just shoot people. <laughs> 
How very American of you. I love it. Oh, very what American. do you do? Oh, mostly I I pose, I show off, I complain. Oh, Me? Oh my friend. gosh. I know. <laughs> I am ridiculous. <laughs> I have been all over the world. I have seen the sights and I have discovered the one eternal truth that I am a pies, um, how do you say? All ass. Mm. Asshole. Mm. That too. That too. <laughs> mm. Beautiful. Well, at least you have some self-knowledge. <laughs> Where were you on your journey? All the civilized world. Painting my little pictures, meeting the locals, you know. You a painter? No, I'm a whole ass. I thought we had covered this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, but you paint. Not according to salons at Paris, no. According to them, I cannot draw, I cannot paint, and I should go away. And so I went away. You miss Paris? Mm, okay. That smelly, filthy Thanks place for the with old buildings Real and nice ghosts and shit and French people. I have that right here. Hmm? I guess so. Mm. You know, uh, Arthur, Charles. You know Arthur. Oh. Don't believe in art. Dad, mm. thank you for it's gifting the subs. Lies. So much. Believe thank you for the sub gift. They are the truth. Art is lies, but the vagina. That is true. And Breath thank you for subscribing yourself, true. Dad. Thanks. <laughs> you say thank so. you. Trust me, I've tried both. One is better. Much better. <laughs> Much better. <clears throat> so, I uh, must be boring you. Uh, but, here. What is it? Uh, it's just a little doodle. Uh, you know, entirely worthless, unless you want to wipe your bottom with it. But I wanted to say thank you for the drinks. Well, that's well, very kind, you. Charles. Mm. No matter. Good meeting you. Mm. Yeah, that's a three months. Good job for the. Uh, thanks for the three months, Dad. I like this guy. He's cool. He's fun. I like him. I like him. And who is this over by my horse? Who are you all of a sudden? You, kind sir. Will you help the poor? Sure. I ain't so kind. Yes, you are, sir. You have it in you, I can tell. I'm a nasty <laughs> bit of work, father. You're wrong on two counts, sir. I'm a humble brother, a penitent monk, not a priest, and you're a magnificent bit of work. You may have made some some poor choices, but which of us hasn't? <laughs> mm -hmm. You have no idea. But you do, and God does, and that's enough for me and for him. We shall see. That we shall, sir. But why don't you hedge your bets and give two bits to the poor? There are so many who will go hungry tonight. Yeah, let's donate. Sure. I'm a good person. I'm a good Arthur. You, sir. How are you getting on, anyhow? These are a somewhat apathetic lot, I'm afraid. Mm. My, um, my mentor says that America is designed to induce apathy in people. It's a wonderful insight. He must be a wise man, your mentor. <laughs> Well, sometimes he's a downright fool, but... True. Yeah. Usually he's the best man I know. <laughs> Usually. The, the thing is, I'm... Well, mm. poverty will always be with us. But slavery, I, I thought we had banished that. But Saint-Denis is acting as a staging post for shipping slaves out to some of the islands. I don't believe you. It's oh. 1899. Maybe you should take a look for yourself. I've heard that the pawnbroker down the block around the corner... The one with the green door? Well, they say he sells more than forlorn trinkets. Help the poor. Okay. Palm broker down the block oh, around the corner. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to knock you over, my guy. I'm just... Should've moved. <laughs> Should've moved. I'm just trying to not walk so dang slow. You best watch yourself. I'm sorry. Is this where I need to go? Where? Green door. I don't necessarily see a green door. Well. Is that it? I'm very confused. 
Did I go in the wrong area? Did I go in the wrong way? Hello, ma'am. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me, everybody. Good morning to you, sir. Ah, green door. Here we go. Got a few paintings over there. Uh, something for the wife, maybe? You timed it well. Some quality pieces in at the moment. Looking for anything in particular? Are oh, you talking to me? Uh, no. I mean. Well. Just let me know if I'm looking for something in particular, but oh, let's inspect that. Help it all. Something don't seem right. Sir, uh, what are you doing back there? What's back here? Looks like this pulls out or something. Pulls out? No, it's just an old bookcase. Uh, seen better days. I must say, you're like. How about you open that door? Door? What door? The hidden door. I, I saw it. The hidden door in your chest. They made me do it. I, I was always good to them, but they, they forced me to do it, sir. I, I swear. Open the door. Now! Oh, okay, okay. Just pull the big red book on the bookshelf. It's called The Scourge of Crossbreeding by Harold McDougall. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh. I'm really not a bad man. Mm. I recognize that name. Yeah. And I'm not surprised, and I'm not surprised Hello? at all. Hello? Shh, gajate, gajate. Well, uh. oh, it's X. I thought it was Y. Press the No, press an X. Do the thing. Now, don't worry, I'm on your side. Ajúdanos. ¿Quién eres? Mm, come on. Come on. I need to get a new controller. I'm on your side. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. Here, yeah. Come with me. Don't worry. You're gonna be all right now. I promise. That's it. Come on. You'll be safe soon. Let's go back to the monk. This Let him know. Not much farther. Poor bastards. No, we're free, and that's what matters. We've got to trust him. Hello? Apparently, I can't use my Twitch Prime sub until this month's sub runs out. Again, You're gonna have to keep an eye on it then. Just watch like a hawk. Okay, Mr. Monk. Brother, Brother Dorkin's friend. Arthur. Arthur Morgan. Come on. You were right. I found these two in prison Soon in that shop. Oh my. I got you. That's... Well, they are blessed to have met you, Arthur. Trust me in that. They're very unusual. I don't think they speak much English. My brothers, come. Let's go get something to eat. Manger. 
Comida, please. Hey, he forgot Comida. this. Oh. Yes. Thank you. I... Uh... Here. Payment. For your services. I could not have freed these men myself. I uh, no. Keep Get it. To the pool, brother. Thank you. I will. Like I said, magnificent. Keep come it. on. Come, come, come. Come see me again I'm sometime. I'm a good person. I'll work at the old church on Gasper Street in St. Francis. I may be an outlaw, but I'm a good person. Where's my horse? There's my horse. I was not that far in front of you. Or I was I was that far in front of you. You could have you did not have to stop for me. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Um let's look real quick at the map and see I know we've got dust right there. And Oh, at camp we got is that yes, yeah, Strauss and Mary Beth have missions for us. What's Mary Beth? She just needs to speak to me. Okay. Strauss just needs to talk to me. Let's get Sean. Not Sean. Not Sean. Jack. Let's get Jack. I made myself sad. <laughs> I made myself sad. I do apologize, sirs. Excuse me, fan, sir. One book to happiness. One book to truth. What One you saying? book to the future. My book. My book about the path to eternal joy. Money. Be rich. Sir, madam, make something of yourselves. I love you and want to make you happy. Warner. <laughs> Hello, friend. Do you Get want to be quick. rich? Sure. I'll it's take literally one. called Get Rich Quick. Fifty dollars. Fifty dollars for a book and cheap at the price. You read this and you'll want to give me a hundred more. You're a big man with a little brain, aren't you? No, thanks. Forget about it. Huh. Well, you're lost, buddy. Okay. Come here. Come here and buy my book. My book will change Why are you selling it for 50 bucks? I ain't gonna buy a book for 50 bucks. Rich. Rich is who you are, and rich is who you shall be. But you have to read the Maldito book. loco. Hello. Hey, move. Just ride my horse to the park. No, uh. No, 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 see here. No, see here. How do you do? Good call. You either lose fifty dollars or some honor if you do. What course is that book for? Exactly. What the hell? What's going on over here? That's the welcome pamphlet. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's finish our business here in Saint Denis. <laughs> At least I think we're finishing our business here in Saint Denis. We're finishing some business here in Saint Denis. John and Dutch. Let's go, boys. Let's get Jack back. There you are. You boys ready? Of course. What else okay. do you know about this guy? Not much. Just these some slick little greasy-haired European 
really got power and money. Now, listen. If we go in there and start shooting up the place, the boy's gonna get shot, that I guarantee. Better like this, we gotta have settled. a lot of protection. Hey, no one's gonna get shot, Arthur, so everyone just relax. We'll charm them. Trust me. This the place? <coughs> Must be. You okay, John? I guess. Excuse me, sir. We have an appointment to see Mr. Bronte. Who are you? You get your boss down here and now so we can talk about this like gentlemen. Run along now, boy. House is on quiet mode for a bit. Shouldn't be an issue if you're just going to stream, but if you take is a break, Max is in a I heard so much about? Relax. Got you. I got this. Hello, sorry, Amelia. What's up, Dayton? How's it going? Okay. Okay. Don't worry, boys. We come in peace. We just need to straighten a couple of things out with your boss. I see that you're online, Dayton. How's it going? <laughs> Dayton. Chi sono sti buffoni? Sono qui per picciotto. Coi soldi? Why do you take his son? Excuse me. I said, why did you take his son? We ain't got no problems with you, sir. Nor you with us. But if you want to start for 30, mi 30 minutes. There's going to be a lot of folks Gosh. dead in this room before it's done. That's true. So, you walk into my city, stinking of shit and looking like this, and you come into my house before you have a bath and you tell me how to act? You ask me to show compassion. Have I not shown you almost infinite compassion already Don't by simply so allowing you to here. breathe in my presence? Indeed you have. Now, we are simple country folk. All we have is each other. And you have gone and you have took his son over some dispute with some inbred ex-slavers, it ain't got mm -hmm. nothing to do with any one of us. You had nothing to do with destroying the liquor business! We was innocent bystanders. And that which we weren't innocent of, well, we we most surely were ignorant of. Listen here, pal, I don't think you understand the protest. I'm the protest here. Twist words, you yeah, I'm my lie shamelessly. Right you think you are better Ugh. than everyone else. Teodoro. <laughs> that is a very steep woman here. Angelo Bron. <laughs> oh, he's reasonable. Dutch That's Randolin. good. Uh, Arthur Morgan. Arthur, uh, the pleasure is mine. John Marston. <laughs> All mine, please. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, can my friend have his son? Of course, of course. <laughs> but... Uh, should I be out of pocket over a misunderstanding? Oh, of course I know you would not want that, huh? Oh. We're gonna no. have no, to pay no, him. No, no, no. So, how about this? You perform oh, a Senator Tinkian, for thanks for the follow. What's I up? Thank you so much. much. What is it? A couple of people have taken to a grave robe. Oh, look how simple. hard they're all leaning away from each other. So to for touch arms on the couch. <laughs> Arthur just sitting there like... I love this guy. I no, love thank you. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> See, they've taken not only to desecrating the dead, but they've done so without paying a tribute to the living. Thing is, they see my men, of course, they're on a mile. So maybe you two head off, huh? And you, okay. Mr. Van der Lind, well, you tell me more about my manners. <laughs> Salute. 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 <laughs> He's, he's just American salute. Yes, mount my horse. I'm here. Okay. All right. 
Let's go. I'm following you, John. You know where the cemetery is? I think so. Pretty sure I rode by it earlier. It's real impressive. You know, real impressive. You did good holding your tongue in there. Do you trust one word that comes out of that bastard's mouth? We don't even know where Jack is. Listen, we found Bronte. We got in there. Dutch is with him now. All things considered, it could have gone a lot worse. Could have. That poor kid. I ain't been a good father to him. I hope <sighs> he's okay. He's It'll gonna be, be a good father to him, John. It's fine. I figure the Braithwaite's were going to hold Jack Branson for all the money we cost him. They must have sent him here so we couldn't get to him. <laughs> but Bronte knows by now there's no Braithwaite's left to pay him. Jack ain't much use to him anymore. Let's just get this mm -hmm. done. Let Dutch handle the rest. Sounds good. I just hope you're right. Okay. I think this is it. Keep it down. Let's hitch the horses up ahead. You want me to take the other one? Hey. John, John, get out of the way. John, John, get out of the way. We should go on foot John. from here, Arthur. John, get out of the way. John, get out of the way. Okay. Let's go, John. Let's go. Gosh, I really need to play the first Red Dead. Just cause John with his long hair, you little miscreant. Alright. Let's see what's going on in here. Let's see. Sooner we get this done, sooner we get Jack back. Mm-hmm. Stay quiet. We don't want to spook him. like looking around random places I'm hearing a dog I, oh oh I saw someone yeah. dog Hey there, boy. Achoo. Well, they can't be far. Achoo. Let's keep going. Mm. I'll try this way. Mm. Hey. Oh, thanks for the 24 bits, Ethan. Thank you. Watching that dog. Oh, ooh. Here's up. Shush. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I had a bit to drink. Your friend died. That's understandable. You're fine, sir. Carry on. Continue Maybe your morning still... process. They're still with us. You should get yourself home. Continue your morning process, my friend. Hang on. There might be something. What? What might be something? Good. Let's just walk normal. Okay. Why'd you scream it, John? I don't. I don't. Oh. Well. We're
that's the scent of something. Is it the scent of people? I'll go first. You stay close. Shh, hold up. I think I heard something. What? Either the dead are waking up, or somebody's trying to wake them. Okay. Come on. I hear something in there. Get in cover, and we'll bust the door in. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. You boys found my puppies watching! Oh? Oh, Dayton, thanks for Damn the it. tier two. Oh, Three, four, go. You should have paid Mr. Conte. Oh, my gosh. Come on, let's get the hell out of here. They're oh, my gosh. Careful. They're leading us out in the open. Nice. Love a good graveyard okay. shootout. We'll need to be quick. We can't go back to Bronte empty-handed. Let's have a look where they first shot at us from. <sighs> Robbing grave robbers. We've hit the big time. First, I want to lead him. So that was some money. We can't go back to Bronte with nothing to show for. I Bronte. know. Why are you trying to leave then? Most efficient type of shootout. We're already in the graveyard. It's fine. Come on. Let's quickly check that spot where it all kicked off. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna, Can you let me do what I need to do? John, get out of my like way. I said, let's look around where they jump. Well, there's another body. Let me gr grab this body real quick. I think there might be oh. something in here. Well, there's also that. Got it. Good. Now let's get out of here. I'm sorry. I'm looting. Shit. It's the law. Oh, nope. Let's Never go. mind. Maybe we can get out that gate. It's locked. We'll have to go back the way we came. I figured that out. John. We best stick to the side. I'm going. Oh my gosh. There's someone coming. Hide. I found a body. Looks fresh. Still bleeding. Looks just been killed. They're still here. Okay. With me. I'm following you, Marston. You're not super great at this.
Go, 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 go. Go. John, go. John, go. Come on, quick. Let's get back to Dutch. Jeez Louise. Okay, Yes, the cones. The cones of Denshire. It's about the cones. Well, it's lucky I ain't a religious man. Let's just get back there, collect our side of the deal. You yep, right? sounds good. He best not be playing games with us. He almost certainly is. Well, let's just see. Keep your head. Act normal. How's he even gonna know we did what he asked? I got a feeling most things around here get back to him pretty fast. Like I said, would you see where we're at once we got Jack? Gotta hitch up my horse and go. Come on, Arthur. I am. You need to chill out, John. Chill the heck out. Hello. Well, you took your time. Jack. Where's your host? Ah. Like I said, you took <laughs> your time. Ah. I'm glad to see you. Let's get going. Oh. What a fine man. Hey, friend. Uh, thank Mr. Look. Bronte you for right? everything. Yeah, I'm fine. Come on. You know, Arthur, Mr. Bronte has invited us to a garden party at the mayor's house. <laughs> Oh, really? And us, just simple country boys. Let's go. We have a new Jeez, Louise. You're gonna love it. Let's get Jack back to camp. Right. Let's get this boy back to his mother. Yep. You sure you're okay, son? I'm fine. Papa Bronte said you'd come for me. I'm. I'm sorry. What for? For that. Take it so long. I had a fun time. I had my own room with a big bed and a toy box. Wow. And lots of books. Did they do anything to you? Have you ever had spaghetti? What? What's that? It's food. It looks like worms, but it's delicious. Is that spaghetti? Right? Papa Bronte teach me lots of Italian words. Don't call him that, please. Do you know cavallo? That means horse. Wow. And Fantafola? That's a slipper. A slipper? They gave me two pairs. One for day and one for night. Oh. Well, uh, I'm just glad you're alright. Oh, yes. I had the best time. But I can't wait to see Mama. Did she miss me? She sure did. <laughs> like you wouldn't know. <laughs> this boy. This boy. Dang, dang. <laughs> oh, dang. It's a lot. He has such a good time. They treated him so nicely. I can't believe it. He got to eat spaghetti. I need to brush my horse. Pigs squealing. Squealing pigs in the distance. Italian. <laughs> you ever eat that? Come here, you silly boy. <laughs> you got him. 
You got my son back. Dutch, Arthur, thank you. Thank you. I got my son back! Jack, Jack, Jack. How are you, boy? I'm fine, thanks. Everything's okay now. Mm -hmm. Abigail? Can I go play now? <sighs> so, well... We met Mr. Bronte. <laughs> he is uh, quite a character. Is he not? Yep. You ever meet an Italian strong man before? <sighs> not outside of a circus. Well, let me tell you all about him. John, you go be with your family. Arthur, thank you. <laughs> That's it. That's all. Boys, <laughs> Thanks, Arthur. We got some work to do. Interesting work. But first, let's have a drink. <laughs> we got Jack back. <laughs> well, boy, say thank you. We got him back. Thank you, Arthur. I... <clears throat> I don't know how to say it. Thank you. I understand. Come on. It's two guys who don't like to show that they have yes. emotions, <clears throat> having emotions with each other. Family. I love this. I love this. This is so great. And there's Charles and Bill. Hello, Kieran. A bug of replaying this game for me was really uh, experiencing the camp. Yeah, dude. Sadie. A big part, yeah. Hello, Sadie. How you doing, ma'am? Pearson and everybody at camp. It's just having such a good time because Jack's home. All right, let's give this boy a bit of space. See you later. Good to have you back, Jackie. Take that man's top hat. Welcome back, Jack. Thanks. And he's just gonna sit down in the middle of the road? Okay, sure. Come on. Come on. Thanks, Mama. Can I play a little? Of course you can. Well done, John. Couldn't have done it without Dutch and Arthur. The old guy. I'm very relieved. We all are. Yeah. Thank God it worked. What did that say? I didn't even read it. Something about like the gang are celebrating the safe return of Jack. I'll let you Something, find books, get reacquainted. How are you, baby? Hi, Mr. Sandos Cabrones. Ay, ya se secó el jacalito. Onde colgaba mi espada. Thank you for the, for the tunes, Javier. Tahiti. If you say so. <laughs> Mangoes, maidens, paradise, an unspoiled paradise. Yeah, I hope so. Tahiti. Faith, Arthur, have a little faith. The time I was hanged. Here you are. I'm also. Tell us again. 
sure. So I got caught doing something or other. I was just a kid, 17, oh. 18, long before I met Dutch. Jose, it's a long story. Micah sitting over there in his tent, away from everyone else, as he should be. Country chef stealing a chicken, I think it was. I know. It's okay. Eat that all up now, Jack. Okay, Mama. Sorry, I just want to talk to them. Get some drinks down, you. Live a little. I might have a couple. This is a party. Come on. All I love right, Karen. Right. She's, I think, one of my favorites. Bastard. Clean through. Instead, they hang the sheriff. And I got away with nothing more than a sore neck. <laughs> Did he just say something about essentially, essentially the good, the bad, and the ugly? Did he just say that they the good, the bad, and the ugly him? Wait a sec, are we inside or are we supposed to be sleeping outside? Cause like, why? Why is everyone sleeping outside when there's straight up a house? Yeah. As he is drinking. Have a drink! Yeah. Grimshaw and Karen. Ain't no I have no idea, man. <laughs> Them fights was over long ago. Or never happened. It was only invented to make you feel something. Automata's power tripping. That's true. Automata's totally power tripping. Ugh. Ugh. Am I supposed to just be going to bed? Is that like what what the play here is? Like telling me to go to bed? Come on along now, Jack. Time for bed. Time for bed. Not my room? What is that? A book. Existence and Oblivion. Oh, straight up. There's just a, a book. Okay. Straight up, I just got a book now. Or, I just, I just found a book. Okay, this is my camp. This is my bed downstairs. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know, man. Ah. Hello, Hosea. Is this not where I'm? Where I'm supposed to be? Where where is my bed? Criminals escaped from jail. Two criminals escaped from prison in Kettering, Ohio, in broad daylight yesterday. Dutch Vanderlyn and Jose Matthews were arrested after a string of confidence uh, tricks in town over the past few weeks. The men who had been posing as international merchants duped twelve local men and women out of approximately three hundred shares of a fictitious Portuguese shipping company. Um. Here, uh. It is not yet known how they escaped Sheriff Carmichael, who was found bound and naked in their jail cells, refused to comment other than to say that he's extremely embarrassed. The two men are still at large, and anybody with information to where their whereabouts is urged to contact the authorities immediately. Okay, so not my bed, because that's where Jose is sleeping. Oh, no. Where, am I supposed to just go to bed? Is that what the, is that what... 
I don't, I honestly have no clue. I assume I'm just supposed to go to bed, but like, where's my bed at? Where, where am I supposed to go to bed? Food? Food. I have dinner. Dinner has arrived for me. I honestly have no clue where I'm supposed to be going right now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Take it. Get out of here. It needs quiet. I'm so very happy. I got, we got Thai food. So I have, um, yellow curry, a nice delicious milk tea, and like probably some rice. Um, oh, it's John, Abigail, and Jack. How sweet. How sweet, what a, what a gentleman. He lets Abigail have the bed. How kind. Where am I, 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 I can't find, I think I'm supposed to be going to bed, but I can't find my bed. Well, maybe in, in that, that is probably just the like weapons, the ammo shelter, or not shelter, the ammo closet. But. Oh, here's my bed. Okay, there we go. Uh, cool. Fun. Fun. They had a nice little fun celebration bringing. Bringing Jack back. I got a letter. We just got a letter. Fast travel. I want to read this letter. Is, is this not where I read the letter? No, nope, not what I want to do. That's my ammo. What's up? Uh, yeah, so V, V, D, awesome. What's up? How's it going? Thanks for the follow. Uh, got my red curry with chicken and pumpkin. I'm happy. Where, how do I, I want to read my letter. How do I read my letter? Let me text Dayton. How do I read my letter? I'm so very confused. There's a letter here, but I don't know how to read it. I got it, so I got a Mary Beth um, task. We got a Leopold Strauss task. And I saw something else pop up. Yes. Oh, Brother Dorkins. Yes, I will definitely do more quests for Brother Dorkins. Oh, in the satchel documents page. Okay. Uh, no, satchel. No, that's journal. I don't know buttons. I don't know what I'm supposed to be, what, what I press to do anything. Okay, there we go. Um, it's a mysterious sermon, letter from Mary, mind share, granting bear, it's mind claim, a uh, note on the recruitment of young southern men to the cause. Nice. Um, 
I forgot to get salt when I went shopping earlier. My life is over. <laughs> nice. Is it Mysterious Sermon? No, because we already... No, wait, um... It has like a... It has like a marker on the map, and I don't know if I'm supposed to like pick something up, or like what... I don't, I don't, I honestly, I honestly don't know. Dayton usually takes care of this. I know, I know how to combat, I know how to play game, but I don't know how to do little things. Dayton usually takes care of this. Um. I'm old and senile, deal. You're fine. You're fine, Dad. I am so very confused. Rambles through the woods and plains. Ah. First bank robbery newspaper scrap. Uh, April 15th, 1887. Brazen bank robbery. Three men saw it. Major T.J. Belford has been a cashier at the banking house of Lee and Hoyt for a number of years, but nothing prepared him for what transpired last week. Uh, it was about two o'clock. Three men, strangers... Uh, to me came through the door and walked up to the counter one of them the eldest of three was a fine talker and engaged me in conversation suddenly the largest a big sullen young man brandished a firearm and held it up to my face throw your hands up the third one said who appeared to be the boss the other two repeated the order with an oath and the leader said my fine patriotic friends and i are going to relieve you of that gold and introduce a few folks to the benefit of civilization they came across around the counter and grabbed some sacks which contained five thousand dollars in gold they demanded to know where the rest of the money was, and I pointed out three stacks containing silver, but it was too bulky for them. They retreated, and one warned against sounding an alarm. I was never so terrified in my life, Mr. Belford told the reporter. The robbers are reported to have lingered in town, and there are unproven claims that the men traveled to hovels and shanties and even a home for orphans, and gave handfuls of the ill-gotten gains to the poor. <laughs> That's why I love the, the Vanderlyn gang, is because they may be outlaws, but they're nice people. They're good people. Let's look at this photograph. Is that Arthur's mom? Beatrice Morgan, Spring Ranch, 1870. Mm -hmm. Okay then. It's, there's like a piece of paper right there. But it's just want me to fast travel. But I don't want to fast travel. I just want to... Uh, I'm so confused. Good oh, morning, Arthur. Here. Sure is nice seeing the kid back around. I don't know if I could have gone on much longer. All in the past now. Oh, he's still asleep. He's still asleep. We ain't gonna bother him. Still asleep, a little boy. I like that Abigail and John get a place inside the house. I understand that there are people who don't get a place inside the house, but I like that they get a place inside the house. Hello, yes. Uncle. Uncle, what the heck? Another lovely morning. Can I not talk to her? Okay. Okay. I just want to talk to everybody in camp. I want to tell everybody hello and that I love them, except Micah. I want to punch Micah in the face. <clears throat> well, that space on the floor by the stairs is the best place in the house. Yeah, man. Uncle knows. Uncle knows. He knows what's up. He knows what's good, dude. Oh, my head is pounding. 
You okay, Charles? Yeah. You did good getting the boy back. All in the past now. Even Uncle. Uncle, yes, I will agree, Uncle, and love Uncle. Can I talk to Karen? Can I not talk to Karen? Charles, move. I want to say hi to Karen. Can I not say hi to Karen? My bad for trying to talk to Karen. Sadie? So what do you think of this place? You folks sure move around a lot. Yep, that's how it goes. Yep. pretty comfy yeah uncle knows what's up uncle knows what's up hey uncle you're awake I, I had some fun last night everyone's favorite uncle how are you damn well if I do say so <laughs> oh uncle uh, no, I'm not gonna talk to Mary Beth just yet because she's got a quest for me that is a main quest. Um, anybody else? Anybody else? Where's everybody else? I just want to say hello to my friends. I want to tell my friends hi and that I love them. Except for Micah. I want to tell everyone in this camp hello and that I love them except for Micah. I think everyone except for Micah deserves to be told hello and that I love you. Strauss is like out there. Hosea's got a quest for me, so I won't talk to Hosea. Okay, Pearson, I'll come talk to you and say hi. Can I talk to Karen? Please, can I talk to Karen? That ain't tough. See, sharks. Got room here for you, Arthur. Karen. Morning, dear. Grimshaw keeping off your back? I wish. <laughs> no one looking after you except. Love you, Karen. Some scumbags you meet on the street. Folks starving. I'm trying to say hello to Pearson. Desperate. <laughs> Uncle, stop talking. I'm trying to say hello to Pearson. How old were you? Nine. Nine years old, I've been living on my wits. <laughs> well, okay. Do I not even get to see anybody else? Like, there he is. Oh, doctor. Miss Karen. The strong, silent, manly one of us. I love Karen. <laughs> You're drunk. He <laughs> smells drunk. Well, then don't smell it, stuck up. Shit, <laughs> goddamn you. Take it easy, Miss Karen. Love Karen. It doesn't sm smells drunk. Well, they don't smell it. Lenny, my boy. I can't talk to him. He's on guard duty. He's on guard duty. I can't talk to him. Well, where's like Kieran and Javier? Oh, give me one sec. Let in the resident Red Dead expert. That's it. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. It says I have a uh, a letter, but I can't like find it. It looks like there's a letter for me to pick up on the table, but it's not on the table. Upstairs. I was also trying to find everybody so I could tell them hello. Mm-hmm. I was trying to tell everybody except Micah hello. What do you need, Arthur? But I didn't want to talk to Jose or Mary Beth yet because they have quests for me. Uncle was asleep on the floor. Did you wake him up? No, but I did say hi to him when he did wake up. Oh, I see how I woke him up. You okay? I'm sorry, Abigail. You're in coffee? 
Huh? Did you drink coffee? No. Your course is cold now. Yeah, I don't know how that happened. See? But he just says fast, tra fast travel. Oh my gosh. It wasn't letting me inspect it. Angles, my dear baby. Arthur, Angles. I hope this letter finds you well. Thank you. I wanted to thank you for your help with Jamie. He and Daddy are still arguing, but I understand that Jamie is thinking about going back to college. Whatever happens, I believe you saved his life, and we are all truly grateful. Oh, Arthur, I have made such a mess of my life time and again. Why can I not change and be the woman I want to be? Why couldn't mm -hmm. you change and be a man what? and put down all those fantasies that shroud your judgment? Life is very confusing, mm -hmm. and I see now that I'm not very good at it. I'm afraid we've got ourselves into another mess. It's not my fault, but I need your help. I'm staying at the Hotel Grand in San Denis. Oh, Arthur, I know it is wrong to ask you. But I have nobody else, and for what we once had together, Hello? I beg of you, even though I am I'm sorry. ashamed to do so. Yours, Mary. What? What do you want, Mary? What does she want? Mary. Yeah, it's Dayton. Hello. That's 100% Dayton right there. Where's your razor? Put that little mirror down there. Yeah, mirror. Thanks for the 100 bits for Dayton. The what? Mirror? Check inside and see if we got a mirror set up somewhere. Well, like oh, her. Abigail probably inside, opened the door. Inside your room. <laughs> Those cheeks, babe. Looking like a ruffian. Uh, chin and chops. Chin and chops. Yeah. Hey. You might even be able to bring that down one. Like that? Should have pomade my hair. No, no, no. Wait, no. you're going to that party? Is Hosea's quest to that party? I think so. Oh, the your, the garden party. Pomade your hair before you go there. Well, I was gonna do Mary Beth's quest first. I was gonna do the Strauss quest and the Mary quest because those are optional and I want to get them out of the way. Mary and Beth is an option. I know. I was gonna do Mary Beth first because uh, hers had popped up earlier. Okay. So, and then Hosea, and I because be I believe Hosea is just taking me to the mayor's garden party with that, Bronte. That's a long one. Sure. Oh, what's that? What's this? Robin and Stagecoach with Lenny. I kind of want to rob a Stagecoach with Lenny. I do it. Yeah. What are you doing? Nothing? I don't believe you. I love Lenny. It's just a little robbery, all right? Nothing serious. Good. What are you robbing? A stage. There's a stage coming through. According to the fella I met, it'll have a bunch of money aboard and no security whatsoever as it comes up the river trail between here and Catfish Jackson. Okay. That yeah, sounds worth investigating. You and, uh, who? I don't know. I, I thought I'd do it on my own. It'll be unprotected. Won't be a huge take, but I should make out okay. There ain't no such thing as unprotected. Now, who you want to go with? I guess you. <laughs> 
I guess I'll you. I need no hand holding off it. Oh, come on, kid. But if we decide to do it once we've had it, look, I'm taking half the money. <laughs> I right. love Lenny. Let's get going then. It should be on its way right now. <laughs> come on, Lenny, let's go. It seems I like love Lenny. Yesterday, you and me were shooting our way in here to rob those fools. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I'll be glad to leave this place behind if I'm honest. Got a bad feel to it. At least it's got a roof. You've got a roof. Of course, I'm outside with the juniors. Oh, you ain't even 20 years old. Your time will come. He's not even 20? Oh my gosh, he's not even 20. Come on, boy. Baby boy. Follow me. I saw a good spot for an ambush. So who's the fella who told boy. you about this? It's a sound lead. I told you. And what did he have to gain by giving you this information? You mean, did I give him money or a gun? You're just gonna have to trust me on this one, Arthur. Okay. Okay, I do. Sweet baby you boy. You want to prove yourself the past six months? Uh... Don't forget, I was on the run for murder before falling in with you boys. <laughs> for three years. It ain't like I'm new to any of this. Uh, those fellers who killed your pa? Yep. And I'd do it again right now. Of course. What up, Lenny? I love Lenny. All my friends love Lenny. Sweet baby boy. Love Lenny. <laughs> On the stage, where's the stage for that? Okay, here we are. the horses off the road to the right here. I figured we take up position behind these rocks. Yeah, seems good. The stage... Be coming up the river from Catfish Jackson any time now. Okay. I got you. I'm here, Bel Lenny. I'm here and I'm waiting. There it is. And I don't see no escorts neither. <laughs> this should be a cakewalk. Are you sure about that? You see any? As soon as they're close enough, we'll jump out, hit them fast. Just wait for my lead, okay? Wait for my leg. This is a rock. Drop on. your weapons and put your hands in the air. I said drop the weapon. Okay, okay. Just take it easy. All right, boy. Anyone else? Anyone inside there? Answer me. Last chance. Come out or we're coming in. Shit. U.S. Marshals, you're under arrest. God damn it!
you lie? Yes, Dad. Yeah. Are you? Evidently. That was not the way I was expecting things to go. You took us into a trap. Look, <laughs> I'm telling you, it was good information. Wait. Look. Look, there's some money here. Not much. Yeah, it ain't much, because it was a trap. Stage companies do this all the time. They set up traps oh. to catch fools. Shit. Like you and me. <sighs> I feel like a fool. Well, that's good, because you are a fool. <laughs> He's still alive, so don't worry too much about it. Come on, get out of here before any more turn up. All right, see you back at camp. Well. Oh, the achievement I was hoping to unlock. I completed a companion activity with uh, in every camp. We did it, boys. Yeah. We did it, boys. So, I think the play here is... Do we go up to and do these two side quests in Saint Denis, or do we grab the Strauss mission real quick? The Strauss mission is just gonna open up more things. Strauss missions are always collectors. Yeah. Let's go to, up to Sanity. Why did I do that now? Let's go up to Sanity. I got two quests in Sanity that we can do. Let's go do the uh, Brother Dorgans real quick. Let's go. Come out of nowhere, okay? Next thing I was regaining my facilities tied up here. Please cut me free. I got you. I got you. Calm down. I got you. You're free, my friend. You have no idea how thankful I am. You ain't home and dry yet. Run along. Get out of here. I know. I think they hid my things in one of those boxes. Sir, they're yours. Well, guess I'm one of the good guys. Good luck to you. I'm just trying to get this box. Get this box that's underneath here. Cooking gum. These dang gambling readers. I think we might just make our way back to Sanity and then end it for the night. Awesome. Okay, boy. You're all right, boy. 
Noah. I don't know if my mic is picking it up, but um, one of my roommates is doing a remote callback for um, college theater audition stuff, and I can hear him. And it's just like this one yep. <laughs> Let's get back in. We'll hop over to where Brother Dorkins is and probably just save him for tonight. We've done some good. Yep. I like being a Robin Hood outlaw as Arthur. It's very fun. Free some, free some people who are gonna be sold as slaves and give our money to the poor. It's, nice. it's a nice feeling. Chelonian. Uh, okay. Imagine, imagine the bright brotherhood and what they want. Mm -hmm. uh, but no one's persecuted. Alright, man, at the old You remember the cult that Mary's brother was in? Yeah. Those were Chelonians. Oh, oh, they're recruiting in Sandini. They're recruiting everywhere. Mm. Tom Cruise recruits for the Chelonians, allegedly. Don't sue me. Out of the way! <laughs> the, the episode is not out. Por favor. It's warm. W, an upside down M. I, I don't get it. Oh, you will. It, it's like swimming, it takes time. But then it's easy. And the whole world opens to you. I hate this. Hello, mister. Sister, my friend, Mr. Morgan. Oh, sir. Brother Dorkings told me about the wonderful thing you did. Oh, he talks a lot of nonsense. No <laughs> offense. None taken. None taken at all. Hey, stop! He's kids to the worst! Don't hurt him, please! I'm not gonna hurt him. I'm just gonna scream at him. Maybe punch him in the face, but it's not hurting him. It's for his own good. Go. 
It's also not giving me a very big area for like exploration here. Did this? Hey, you know him? He robbed me. Which way you go? Uh, that way. Thank. Thank you. Thank you. Get off me! Where's my watch, you little weasel? I don't know nothing about no damn watch. Last Saturday, I saw you steal it with my own two eyes. Maybe you're out of Hey, you! Why don't you leave the boy alone? What's it to do with you? I can hit a lot harder than you. I promise you that. All right, forget it. Little shit ain't even worth my time. Thanks, mister. Oh, okay, he dropped it. You want some company, mister? No. You sure? Hey. What? I don't know you. This is Downs? Oh, no. Not you. Get away. Hi, now. I mean, I, hey, help. I, well, help. Hold on. This man is bothering now. me. Someone help me. Officer, help. What? Lord. You better hold it. Go ahead. Keep moving. See what I'm sorry, what? I don't think I rightly know what's going on here. I'm wanted. <laughs> well, ouch. I don't think I was bo I don't Calderon without alerting the law. Who was Mrs. Downs? Who was that? The guy that you go to his farm. Okay, I thought that's who it was, but I wasn't certain. There's an officer there. I can't go this way. Brother Dorkins, we should, we'll probably end it there. I should go around the other side of the church, probably. 
If I can go through the church, that would probably be ideal. But I cannot. So this side is. Gratitude and recognition. Mr. Morgan! Excuse me, Father. Sister, I got your cross. <gasps> you didn't! Oh, I did. Oh, I hope the boy. He's fine, physically. Mentally, he's a piece of work, but who am I to say? Brother Dorkins was right about you. You are the most wonderful man. Brother Dorkins is greatly deceived, I'm afraid, but I'm happy to help a little. Thank you. You see, it's a thing, but my mother gave it to me when I was a novice. Shortly before she passed, you are the most wonderful man. Mm. Oh, excuse me, Father. Sister, enjoy your day. See, Father? Brother Dorkins called. Okay, cool. And we're right next to Mary's quest, so with that, we are going to go ahead and end it here for the night. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for saying hi. Thanks for coming along, having a good time. Uh, I know I had a good time. I hope y'all did too. Uh, we will be back here tomorrow, 7 p.m. Central Time, uh, playing some more rootin' tootin' cowboy shooting. the second one. Um, tomorrow. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else. So, um, we'll see you then. Bye! <laughs>